Rocking the uh, OCB Big East Natural shirt. Still all tan and shit. I haven't really scrubbed myself down too hard because starting Thursday my tan is going to come back. So, as you see, my arm's all black and shit still. Not that serious. Um, so, a couple updates, guys. My new camera is coming in the mail. Should be here. It's shipping from California, so it'll probably be here. Um, estimated time of arrival is one to three days, so I'm gonna say probably four days to be honest. But yeah, so I finally got a new camera. Quality is gonna come up pretty cheap, and uh, yeah, I'm gonna be selling my old camera. So if anybody needs a camera, uh, holla at your boy, and uh, maybe we could work something out. Um, we are today's Tuesday. I think we're five days out. I don't really know. Whatever. Fuck it. I don't, I don't even know what's going on right now. I'm so tired. I'm still trying to recover from my no sleep weekend. Um, as for Easter festives, I did indulge a little bit. I shouldn't have, but I had never had cheesecake before. And uh, it was presented to me, so I had some. And I had macarons. I don't know if you know what those are. It's basically little cookies made of egg whites and sweetened milk and a little bit of coconut so they were really good and uh, that's basically what I indulged on. I hardly ate anything all day uh, in order to kind of eat those and not feel too bad about myself but I had a shitty looking omelet right here I used a different kind of egg white this time so that just goes to show you these egg whites right here are the best for making omelets these ones are okay and uh, the green container ones these ones suck. So don't even try to make an omelet with those. Believe it or not, the consistency and the viscosity of the egg whites really does make a difference. So you don't really want that kind. It's a little runny. That's it, guys. It's finally here. Uh, I'll show you my trophies, actually. Um, this one right here is my third place for juniors. Um, this one is my fourth place for novice A. Um, this one is my um, fifth place novice um, from the OCB show in March. Second place teen um, finalist, which means last place, I think, in the um, debut class. So, yeah. Um, so that's all my accolades. Basically, um, I was number 33 for the first show and number 22 for the second show. So that's pretty cool. Um, but basically, guys, what I'm making this video about is I've got some big news. Um, basically, I got in contact with a, one of the judges from... Actually, I talked to a bunch of the judges. Um, and uh, what I came to the conclusion was I spoke with my man, Tony you know the IFPA pro that I talked about many times and uh, basically shit is going down guys 2014 is my year and I cannot fucking wait okay check it I have my new workout routine things are going great I'm getting stronger again finally um, I'm hoping after this show to incorporate my deadlifts again um, hopefully I can get back up to like the 500 pound mark I don't even know what I'm at now it's just my body's aching so bad like squats are just difficult they're killing my body I actually might need to take like a week and kind of like basically take it off you know deloads I don't know maybe just do like arms basically every other day <laughs> but what is going to happen guys okay so I wanted to get peeled right I wanted to get big through talking to Tony and my other source here uh, that I'll talk about in a second I'm gonna do both okay now how might that be you don't want to compete in too much of a time frame like for example it was really tough for me to compete March 29th April 19th April 26th you know it's a three week gap and then a one week gap it's really tough you know uh, and I've been prepping for about 26, I think, weeks, or 28 weeks, and um, it's tough, and you know, the way I'm going to go about it next time is a totally different way, so I'm going to be transferring colleges 
to a school that is about 40 minutes away. I'm still going to commute from my house. I'm not staying on campus. So uh, that's cool. Well, it's about 25 to 30 minutes because I drive really fast like a psycho. But the cool thing is it's like 10 minutes away from my gym, powerhouse gym. Remember when I used to go there? I've been training at my local YMCA because of time and money and, you know, convenience, basically, it goes along with it. But I need to go back to Powerhouse, where I belong. Good machines, great environment. Um, it's a little tough for me to record there, so I'm going to talk to the owners and see if maybe I can, you know, figure something out so that way I can record or just sneak it. Um, but that's besides the point. So I'm going to have my gym back. And... What's also about five minutes, not even from the gym, is Chipotle. So I'll be going there basically every day that I work out. <laughs> and uh, that's going to be awesome. So what am I going to be doing? Well, big news is coming, okay? I have my coach selected. Yes, I have my coach. Uh, we've been talking a lot the last few few days. We talked a, a couple weeks ago. And... Um, we basically went over what we wanted to do and now we have a new plan of what we're going to do and it's very effective I feel what I'm going to be doing is this last show is going to be the near end of my contest prep okay now what I mean by that is April 26th is my Albany show that is this Saturday uh, today's Tuesday uh, almost Wednesday so I'm going to enjoy myself afterward, have me some Chipotle, probably some ice cream, okay? And then I'm going to, I'm starting my reverse diet as of today. So I'm going to be doing this for about probably two weeks. Um, he did not tell me to reverse diet, but that's how I'm taking it. Um, my coach's name is Paul Ayadamasi, I believe that's how you pronounce it. Um... So for future plans, okay, so my coach, um, you know, we're going to be keeping in touch, but my contest prep begins in June, okay, June. Now, I'm going to be doing a lean bulk, if you will. Uh, my workout's going to be the same, my four-day workout, but I'm going to be throwing in a fifth day for arms because um, it's kind of a short off-season. It's going to be about two months or so. Um, being in the off season, and I'm really gonna pound my abs and pound my arms to, you know, make an attempt at building a little bit more muscle than I would normally. And uh, basically, I'm doing a 16 week prep, which is a much less than last time. And what he's gonna be doing is trying to fill me out first, then lean me out. So, um, you know, he remembers me from the contest because he judged uh, for me. And uh, I sent him pics, and he reevaluated, and um, so that's what we're going to be doing. So I have my coach and everything, and uh, that's basically the same thing that Tony said. Basically the same approach. Now, my 16-week prep is going to prepare me for his show. Believe it or not, it's called the OCB Natural Eastern USA on October 18th, 2014. Uh, that is in Rochester, and about a month later is another one of Mike Halsey's OCB shows, and this is the New York State Natural, one of the biggest shows in New York State. Uh, this is going to be even bigger than the Liberty State, so it's going to be huge. I think this year there was 170 people, 180 people there, which actually I kind of think it was even more. It might have been upwards of 300, because it's one of the last of the year. Um, I don't recall, but that one's November 15th, so I'm going to be doing those two shows, so it's going to be basically a 16 and a 20 week prep, which isn't bad, and uh, with a coach managing my nutrition, cardio, supplementation, uh, weight, everything like that, that's less stress on me, and through changing my college, what I'm going to be going to school for is nutrition and dietetics. Um, it is an associate program, and I'll probably continue on for my bachelor's, 
but that's probably a year or two away because I don't know if this school is going to take my credits. I'm still waiting back for my uh, transfer bullshit. You know, it's a long, drawn-out process. But that's just a look at what's going to be happening in the future. Coach, new shows, um, my reverse diet. And, um, oh yeah, in case you guys didn't know, I'm not doing cardio. I haven't done cardio in about a month, probably. I mean, I did it like one or two days. Uh, I did like 20 minutes of lists. But, um, yeah, so I will be stepping on stage again. And, um, chances are that I will be, I will have this entire show recorded for you guys. Last time I got the posing routine, but the, my girlfriend was a little shaky and the light was kind of blurred, but I have my new camera coming in. It should be here probably Thursday or Friday, so I'll be able to record on a better camera. If not, I'll still use this one. I have a lot of support for this show, so let's fuck shit up. Reverse diet, and we're out of here.